Health Minister Joe Paitha has announced two new cases of cholera in Limpopo, but he adds there's no need to panic. These cases are suspected to be from neighboring Zimbabwe, as the country has been battling the outbreak for months. I must emphasize that at this stage, except for the imported cases and the two new cases of local which have got no travel history in, in Limpopo, in the Blueback municipality. We don't really have a very, any reason for, for any panic. And there's been a public uproar about the high number of medical graduates who do not have a job in this country. This while public facilities face dire staff shortages. Patla says the main problem is budget constraints. He says the 7.5% salary increase is putting pressure on hospital finances. The provinces do face a lot of challenges in terms of budgetary constraints. There is a lot of pressure on the budgets uh, because um, as, you know, uh, cost of employment uh, increases, uh, they, they get under more and more pressure. And, uh, and, of course, just to also come to another pressure over the last year, which added to the pressure on the, on the salary bill was the, uh, the, the agreement between government and the trade unions for a 7.5% salary increase because uh, this also affects the, 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 the category of medical officers. They also benefit from that 7.5%. So all this puts a lot of pressure in terms of the finances of, uh, of provinces and even at, at individual hospitals. There are many hospitals where the pressure is such that even before this increases, they were already approaching 70% of their annual budgets being for salaries. So the risk in terms of this is that it crowds out the full budget in terms of medicines, in terms of linen, in terms of many other, including uh, clinical equipment like x-rays, ultrasounds, uh, CT scans, and all those sophisticated machines which are required. All, all the kind of the things which you need just to run the service uh, become uh, uh, quite quite crowded.